Oh boy, look at the lights on that one, eh? The chassis, the curves, Strix, eh? Oh, I think I know a stripper with a name like that once. What? That one's a three slaughter! Nitro, that one definitely has a good show. Oh, hey guys. Hey, it's not what you think, eh? I'm just looking at video cards. But I knew you thought I was looking at something else because I know my wife came down the stairs the other night and she thought the same thing, eh? She could hear the stuff coming out of my mouth, but she couldn't see the screen. Next thing you know, I'm getting an iPhone 12 in the back of the head from across the room and then she's running, screaming, knocking me out of my wheelie chair here, sending me flying. She did apologize after, eh? But I still had to pay for the screen on the iPhone. Go figure. I can't figure that one out, eh? But, uh, yeah. Video cards. Look at that, eh? Can you believe the prices? $17.99. $14.99. $19.99. Sounds like I'm reading from the Farmer's Almanac. Those should be years, eh? Not prices. Can't believe that. Normally in these videos, hey, I paint with you guys, but we don't have time for that today, so I painted one beforehand. That's got to go up on the eBay. I think it's 1800 quid or something. I don't know what a quid is, but I hope it translates into something good for this guy, because I just bought one of them video cards. You know, I remember not too long ago, like, not the last video card I bought, because I thought that was crazy at $800 four years ago, but the ones before that. If you bought a top of the line card back in the day, it was $400 and you were nuts. Now, you need to remortgage the house, sell your first kid, and give your dog up for adoption because you're not going to be able to afford to feed him. $1,700 and I've been waiting since August, okay? It's now January. I've got a computer you guys know in the, in the closet. I just, I got one to sell here. I got to build the second one. Got to the point where I had to do what I had to do, eh? Now, my wife will tell you I didn't have to, eh? Because, uh... She thinks the truth of it is it's all about video games and uh, the new card's gonna really rock at video games and uh, don't let her know, eh? But that kind of is, that's, that's a good half of the reason, eh? But I said, I swore I wouldn't pay them scalpers, eh? Well, you know what gets me? Them scalpers now, they're not only on eBay, they're actually into stores. Yeah, I, so here's the thing, okay? There's only three places in Canada you can buy a video card online right now. Memory Express, Canada Computers, and Newegg, eh? And they're all crooks. Okay, so Memory Express, they won't ship anything. You gotta go to the store. Canada Computers, it's the same, eh? I live up here in the north. You guys know there's nothing around here but bush. I called Canada Computers. They had a video card in stock in Barrie, which is like, for me, it's a four and a half hour round trip, eh? I said to them, I'll pay you right now, I'll drive down and get it, I got some work to do on Tuesday, can you guys hold it for me? No, can't do that. And I, I couldn't figure out, I said like, you guys have to understand, eh? I've been watching the computer two hours a day, an hour every morning, an hour before I go to bed, and I'm clicking refresh, 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 and the off chance that I get to see one of these mysterious new products in stock, eh? That's how bad it is, literally seconds. If it's on your screen, you don't have time to put it in your cart and check out. I've had that happen once in six months, okay? Once did I see an item that I could put in my cart and by the time I got to the cart to pay for it, it was already gone. Well, the same thing happened when I called these kids down, eh? Some stupid kid answers a phone and you can't negotiate with the kid, eh? I didn't have time to talk to a manager because as I'm talking to the kid, he says, no, we can't hold video cards for you and uh, you have to pay in person. And then he says, never mind. There's a guy here, he's holding it in his hand, I can envision it, and he's like telling me all about this card, and I want it so bad I can taste it, and then he says, there's a guy here who wants it, and I gotta sell it to him. Just like that, it was gone. There goes the dream. I'm back to having a machine sitting in the closet collecting dust, eh, that I already spent over two grand on. Anyway, so that kind of annoyed me, but then it, it made me realize there's only one place, New Egg, that you can buy online, that they'll ship you online. So I've been watching every day, and it just so happened the other day, eh, one of these cards, a new fancy, not even the really 
Not even the one I wanted, okay? So if you want a mainstream video, video card, $1,200 will get you the best bang for the buck, okay? Then they make these outrageous priced $6,900 for A and B side and the $3,090 for the NVIDIA side. NVIDIA and AMD, those are the two competing. They're the only two that make video cards in the whole dang world, okay? So you gotta buy one of their two products. Anyway, if you buy the mid-tier product, you pay $1,200. If you want 10% more performance, you pay 70% more money. And of course, that's what I seen on here the other day. Eh? Nobody wanted to pay the money for it. And there was one, one left. And I'm like, oh God, make a decision quick, right? I got two seconds. So I made the decision to go for it. Well, and then next thing I know, it was in my cart. Next thing you know, I had clicked pay for it. Next thing I know, I got a, an email saying they were sending it to me. And I said, oh, what did I just do, eh? $17.99 plus tax for a video card. I don't want to pay! I don't want to pay! Oh, you've been eating poop again, haven't you, boy? But it got me thinking, eh? The last time when I spent $800 on that video card, I had a solution. There's another part to this problem which might be Gary's salvation, eh? It's called mining. The Bitcoin. Yeah. When they come out with these new video cards that are so good and so grandiose and they can do oh a hundred times more things than the old one can do, people start buying them to do mining because now they can mine all these imaginary Bitcoin thingies. I, all I know is I made $400 off of it in 2017, eh? And the reason I did it was because I paid way too much for my video card. So I plugged a new video card in and I learned how to mine and I made $400 in two months and then I never did it again. Kind of forgot how to do it, eh? So, Got me thinking. There's another mining boom on right now because of this new explosion of new cards. And I thought, Gary's got to get back into that, eh? So, as a pretest, I hooked up my desktop computer and my laptop computer. And they've been running for two days. And after two days, I made $15. But, eh, that's the old technology. Them's the old video cards. The new one should be able to do that much in a day. As long as the market don't crash before I get the new card. Can you hear that, eh? I'm not joking. It's mining bitcoins and the fan's been running on full all night. I guess that's what I gotta put up with to make some money around here. The old video card and the laptop both have one year warranty left on them, so we're just gonna let them run till they burn out, eh? If I can make 300 bucks before that happens and then send them in for repair, who's gonna win? Maybe this guy. Now I know, eh, some of you are gonna ask me, what is a Bitcoin? I don't know. I can't honestly tell you, I've never seen one, eh? You just set your computer to do some kind of mathematical equation, eh? And the better your video card is, the more math it can do, eh? So it's kind of like Gary on steroids. Pretty good at the math, eh, but not that good. I wouldn't make any Bitcoin using this thing. So I gotta use the video card. This is how, I don't know how it's controlled. I think the guy who made this was a Chinese Einstein or something, right? He's laughing. He's, he's a billionaire now, probably, right? He tells everybody that it's, it's just a generic thing, eh? But if I was going to build that system, eh, why wouldn't you have it already? You've been running your own computer for 20 years before you release it to the public, eh? And I got 80 billion bitcoins. Yeah, he's not fooling Gary. So I don't know how it works. I don't know what it is. All I know is you can get real money in your account. I made $400, as I said before. We're going to try it again, eh? Now, back to the video card story here. Newegg. Okay, these guys are crooks. Not only are the scalpers selling these cards for like, you know, seven, eight hundred dollars more than they should be. I, when I bought it on Newegg, I noticed before I bought it, but I only had two seconds to figure, to do a calculation, but it was two hundred dollars higher than the MSRP. Yeah, they screwed me. And then to boot on top of that, they don't even send you a two thousand dollar Graphics card, yeah, with tax, that's what it costs this guy, eh? 2000 I still can't believe I'm saying that. Anyway, then they charge you for shipping. $15 to ship me the product at any other store out there, you know, Best Buy, Amazon, eh? They'll send it right to you for free. I love me the Amazon, eh? But what you Americans don't realize, and they don't have any video cards, nobody can get these things. Yeah, I would have bought it on Amazon, I'm a member. Oh, yeah, I'm a Prime member, eh? It's a little different in Canada. 
Two guys got the .ca domain, eh? They work out of their mother's basement and they handle all the shipments for Canada. The two-day shipping delivery thing is just a suggestion here in Canada, eh? You, you complain or you call them and say, where's my shipment? It's been seven days. Oh, it's coming, sir. You know, they, they tell you right away, eh? You gotta be patient. I always get it. Sooner or later, eh? Comes in on the old Camel Express. The mail system here, nothing. Oh, you don't want to write home about that. She'd never get the letter. I know I'm all over the place. I'm so rattled, eh? I can't believe I spent that much money on a video card. That's why I'm making the video for you guys, you know? I figure I make a dollar a video off YouTube. I got a heck of a lot more videos to get making here to pay for this new card. And all so that I can render these 4K glorious videos for you guys about nine seconds faster than I could with the old card. But there's still nine seconds, eh? Some people are gonna wonder, eh, why is Gary doing another painting with Canada video? He just did one. Well, the last one, guys, I'll tell you, it did two things, eh? It kind of spread the word that, uh, that this guy knows some stuff, eh? Nuggets of knowledge. There was some good stuff in there. A lot of people told me how much it's helping them, eh? Just to have a chuckle. I like to have a chuckle. And I lost five subscribers. That's awesome, eh? Because you know what? Those were the five a-holes that were thumbs down on me all the time. Good riddance, Tom. Oh, we'll make up. We'll have a beer tonight over the Leaf game, eh? Go Leafs! Well, I better do some work, eh? Thanks for joining me, guys. Keep your eye open for that nice turtle painting I did, eh? On eBay, like I said, I think it's about 1,700 quid. Taken into exchange rate into account, I don't know. Highest bidder takes it, eh? Send me a private message. I, I will negotiate. I'm desperate. See you guys in the next video, eh?